Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be showing you what I got in my May Ipsy. I did receive it like a week ago, but as you can tell, we're in a different location because I did start selling jewelry as a way to make income for my family. My ring light keeps shaking, I apologize, but um, if any of you are interested in... Wow, this thing will not settle. Um, if any of you are interested in buying a piece of jewelry, it is all lead and nickel free. I sell through a company called Paparazzi Jewelry. Each piece is $5. All the necklaces you see, you can't see my finger, but <laughs> there. All the necklaces you see come with a pair of matching earrings. Um, I just reordered a few more things or ordered a few more different things. But um, yeah, if you want, you can follow my Facebook page, which is Amber's Glamour Shop. Um, has a big paparazzi logo in the back shaking again anyway for the reason that we're here ipsy is now a 12 dollars a month subscription you get five sample to deluxe size products um you go online you fill out your little quiz what skin tone you are what you like if you're makeup heavy if you don't really like makeup and you like more skincare um comes in a cute little bag every month i'm kind of disappointed in this month i don't know if it's because i haven't really filled out a survey for them in a good like almost two years or it's just the way they're being um but i guess let's get into it i only got one makeup item this month i don't want to sound ungrateful i really don't but oh my zipper's broken um because i try to shove everything in there but this is what the bag looks like for this month i think it's flowers i'm not entirely sure it's cute it'll just go right into uh the top thing where my um makeup bags go that I've showed you before. Wow. Shaky, shaky every time I bump my desk. This is the card it comes with. They're now sending in the open up cards with all the um, full size item prices and what it is and how to use it, tips and tricks, so on and such forth. So the first item that I have is the Seraphine Botanicals Hibiscus in Biome Glowing Lip Mask. Um, I've been using a lip balm from BoxyCharm and it's almost gone and I'm so sad about it, but it's been working very well. Um, let's see, I guess we should read about it. Um, this is, I guess this is full size. It retails for $25. That's kind of crazy, but it says, say goodbye to dry chapped lips with hydrating leave on treatment that truly leaves lives up to its name. It's made with nourishing plant butters and soothing sweet orange and hibiscus extracts to give your lips a dewy glow. The tip says, sleep your way to a smoother, supple smile by adding this mask to your PM routine. It's a pull tab, I haven't opened it yet. Like I said, it's just been sitting on my desk. I've been so busy with this jewelry stuff, which I mean, it's not a bad thing. I'm enjoying, oh, it's oily, oily. It smells good. It's a pretty color too. So that is that. I'm gonna put that over here and try not to shave my desk too much. Um, the second product is, wow. The second product is Ahava Dead Sea Water Mineral Body Lotion in Spring Blossom. I really like that color. Um, just making sure you guys weren't shaking. It says treat your skin and sense Senses with this floral scented body cream, it instantly smooths and softens dry, flaky skin with a blend of aloe vera, aloe vera witch hazel, and nutrient rich dead sea water. And the sweet floral aroma is perfect for spring and summer season. This is a deluxe size sample. The full size sample is $31. I don't think I'd ever pay that much for a lotion. Yeah, a body lotion. Uh, it says apply a generous amount to clean skin after bathing or as needed throughout the day. Um, another little tabby tab it's full all the way oh nope i lied it's not full all the way it's about to here so i got a little bit i can see through the bottle with my ring light if i can I always told the kids not to use their teeth to open anything but now i physically can't open this and i just ripped off the little tabby yeah i Oh, I thought I had it. Now this channel has turned into watch Amber struggle open a bottle of lotion. Oh, this thing is really glued on. 
I mean, I guess that's a good thing because it's a safety seal, but. Finally, all right. Smells good, just a typical white lotion. So that is the second thing. The third thing we're gonna talk about is this, something that I've never gotten before, Gold Fat and MDs, unbalanced, if you have unbalanced complexion, solution, pure start, gentle detoxifying facial cleanser. It says a daily multitasking advanced cleanser that dissolves impurities, removes dead skin, excess oil and or makeup in one simple step. It has wheat protein, botanical cleansing agents and grapefruit peel oil. Um, I can't, I think it's clear, so I can't really see if it's completely full, but the thing that sucks about this, well, obviously it doesn't suck because if you like it, the whole, like, some of it, the whole reason is to repurchase the full product if it works for you, but, um, it says cleanse and detoxify your skin without stripping its protective barrier in the morning and at night with this innovative face wash. It uses seaweed extract and wheat proteins to help your skin retain moisture, rose hip seed oil to smooth and firm, and botanical, potent botanical to purify pores. Stop, guys. The kids are over there sitting on the couch. Uh, gently massage a generous amount into damp skin and then rinse with warm water. Um, this is a deluxe size sample. The full size version of this is $35. So yet yeah, another skincare product. Um, the fourth thing I'm not very happy about, mainly because I don't, I put down no nail polish on my thing, but whatever. This is the Contact Skin Nail Lacquer in Showstopper. It's a pretty color, kind of looks like the YouTube button, um, but again, I don't paint my nails, so I, I had no need for this. Um, this is a full size, obviously, it retails for $15. It says this ultra shiny and chip resistant orange red color is about to be your new go-to for all your spring and summer occasions. Plus the seven free formula is made without some of the harmful ingredients found in many polishes. It, so it doesn't just look good, it's good for you too. The tip is to prep your nails as usual, then apply two thin coats of color followed by a top coat. I don't know what to say about it. I was thinking about painting one of my nails for you guys to show you how it is on a nail, but then I don't want to either have one red nail all day or paint all of them just for them to chip, even though it says it's chip resistant. I have so many nail polishes that say they're chip resistant and they're not. So that is that. The last and final product is the only makeup product we have. It is the Complex Culture Let Up Concealer Mini in F100. Um, it looks a little light even for me, but we'll see. Equal parts makeup and skincare. This good for you concealer hides redness, breakouts, and dark circles with lightweight buildable pigments. Pigments. It helps moisturize and protect your skin with ceramides and antioxidants and brightens it with vitamin C, a win-win for your skin. This is the deluxe size sample. The full size is retailed for $25. The tip is to dot on the skin, then blend and build to achieve your desired level of coverage. Um... Yeah, I'm just gonna, I don't have any makeup wipes out here. That's probably another thing I need to put on my desk or somewhere near my desk. Some makeup wipes. Oh, that is a weird doe foot. And it smells funny. Yeah, that's even a little bit too light for me, which is odd because I'm Casper the Friendly Ghost. And it smells like suntan lotion. But I guess, <laughs> so we got a lot of skincare, a lotion, a facial cleanser, a lip mask, a nail polish, and one thing of makeup, which is the concealer. Um, I can't say I'm very happy with Ipsy this month. I don't know if it's because, like I said earlier, that I have to update my um, profile and review all the bags that I haven't yet, or they're just, I don't know, being Ipsy, I don't know. I've had Ipsy for a long time now, so I'm thinking about maybe looking into um, Glossy Box, but I'm not entirely sure. But I'm just gonna... Go and put this stuff away, throw my phone on charge, and probably take the kids to the park in a little bit. 
it's too nice to stay inside so like i said that was ipsy um did you guys get ipsy what did you like was it similar to my bag did you get anything that i got i think i'll probably honestly use that concealer for an eyeshadow primer when i do run out of my actual eyeshadow primer mainly because it's just not my skin tone so i don't know what else i would use it for so that was what was in my ipsy if you guys are interested in any jewelry behind me please follow my page or um dm me on instagram either way um the link for my instagram will be in the description below and i hope you guys have a great sunday is it sunday yeah sunday <laughs> bye